Hey guys, and welcome to the breakdown of Eka Buja Swastikasana 2, aka the peace sign. Nah, just kidding, it's a shoulder closer. <laughs> so, this is in compensation for the shoulder opener we just did. Now you're going to learn how to compensate and close that shoulder. It's going to be on the ground. Now, for alignment purposes, I'm going to show what this asana looks facing this way as well as facing side, so you can see both alignment. Go ahead and lower the belly all the way down. Start by relaxing your left arm down the left side body, left palm to face the ceiling. Now, my beginners, you might even have to roll onto your right side body once you get that right arm out to 90 degrees. Again, it's not all the way up here. It's not all the way down here. Directly on the same plane as your shoulder. You can go ahead and rotate that left shoulder in. And again, left palm faces the ceiling, right palm faces the ground. For my intermediates, you can go ahead and kick your right leg out to 90 degrees. And for my advanced students, go ahead and kick both legs out to the side at 90 degrees. Whichever arm is stretching, the leg should be heading out towards that side as you take your level three twist. Now I'm gonna show this from the side. Break dance move, woohoo! <laughs> All right, belly down. Relax your left arm down the left side body. My beginners, left arm walks its way underneath the throat. Can you see from the side how my right hand is on the same plane as my left shoulder and my right shoulder? This is proper alignment. And again, you can kick those legs out to the side at 90 degrees if that feels comfortable. But that is the breakdown of Eka Bhuja Swastikasana. Peace sign. Nah, just kidding too. <laughs>